I'm the reason why my city hot. I'm the reason why they spin blacks. Good afternoon to you, my rollers. You already know there's a cute guy behind you in front of the camera these days. This might not mean himself. And I'm with my cousin O'Neill today. And we're gonna do a review of a new song. It was supposed to come out last week. I'm sorry. I know I said I'm gonna keep a, a regular schedule on the reviews and everything. Every week I'm gonna drop two. You feel me? But yeah, today we're gonna go right back into bed, yeah, because he's the most wanted artist as to say right now bed is one of the hottest artists top ranking that that should say that top ranking you feel me i ask you guys to let me know which other artists to review and you come right back into bed yeah today we're gonna do the truth it's self-explanatory it's the truth let's get right into it i got everything pulled up right now i got a computer on this side you ready for this now i'm ready for it i was ready man. all right good so you already know Straight opinions, personal opinions, business opinions, whatever. It's all welcome. You already see how I do this already. Yeah, you know, me? Sure. We come in, we listen to the track. You know, you give however you think it sound, the quality, you know, the lyrics. We're breaking down everything today. You feel me? Life of my road. Let's get it. Like I said already, this sound is called The Truth by Bedia. This one, your name, the truth. Nothing but the truth. You believe in yourself, yeah. No matter what. Look. I was the age of 14 when Blaze Antonio had the music. Now I'm 19, him have a boss crazy in it. From them time, the boy they are blazing. John, I'm a respect you, dog. You see a dream, you went along and chased it. Enough for them, we are rolling with you now. Them are wagonists. If them are real fun, I ask them about the deuces. Yo, me I tell you, bro. From them time, man, I follow you. Chip it up, you soon must. Remember, baby, I tell you that, you know. Me used to. Alright, I gotta stop right here. We're pretty early on. I could relate to exactly what Betty is saying right now because I remember back in the days we used to be at Brutal Trucks and they used to have like a cypher every week, you feel me? I remember when Ken used to be out yeah. there, the Prodigy used to be out there. A lot of rappers used to be out there. That was like the rap scene for, for Ghana, you feel me? You go out there, you link up and you battle whoever and people come out with a different styles, you feel me? I met a lot of artists there. And um, Blaze was definitely one that used to be out there because he used to rock with his group and whatever. I ain't gonna get too much into that, but he used to rock with a group that probably used to rock with. And, you know, things went left or whatever, but I remember them days, honestly. So when he said he talk about the truth and remembering from way back then, he was 14. I was probably a couple years older than that, but I do remember going out there a couple weekends and vibing with them, you feel me? It was, it was pretty nice. It was something that they should have kept going, honestly, for, you know, to build the music. They should have kept that going. I guess that was you guys' failure. Hey. My brute of record. Yeah, you and the man, them used to freestyle at the yard. Cypher. From them time, you know, say your bad. Keep it up. You have to make it down. Hey. Let's speak about the church. Let's talk about the church. Yeah. yeah. Let's speak about the church. I'm bad, yeah. You see the girl when they retire, boy, yeah? Me did rate, yo. The true colors are shown now. Don't know, me get for eight, yo. We treat you like family and jealousy. Make you get so. You see, I some of the two red people now. Let me tell you why me rate. Jackie Jackson, keep it real, she spit the facts. At least, she not fake like her next eyelash. At least, she keep it real, she not care about backlash. At least, she the realest. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. What do you think about that? That shit hot. <laughs> that shit hot. You hey. talk about Ernesta. I lash. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I'm gonna lie, Jackie Jacks, um, for Guyana, she is the rise. Mm -hmm. Honestly, hands down, she is the rise. You feel me? She she is as it comes. Like he said, there's there's no embarrassment, there's no shame. Like she talk just how they say we supposed to talk, you feel me? However, Guyanese supposed to sound where well, I don't know how we supposed to sound when we mix, but Shit, but um, culture wise, she really put down to the culture when it comes to the music and everything. You feel me? She's fully raw, like, I, I especially when she's performing and shit. Yo, that's dope. Shout out to Jackie Jack. You feel me? Let's talk about the promoter, them from the other dog. The red that cheat them more like shit, me I tell you, dog. The red that show overseas artists more love, you know. Suck, no matter, 
speak about the truth. Yo, <laughs> I love promoting that. Honestly, none of them is possible. You understand? Me? And I said it with all. Uh, however, I want to take it. I want to take it because. From every other promoter that know me and them had problem and DJ and select and wherever you want to call yourself and we've been at problem from since since back in the days. Yo, no man just call it everybody yo. You should you should just start name dropping blam 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 blam. You understand me? And expose everybody because y'all feel say y'all on the radio and y'all y'all getting the gigs here and then running to parties. Y'all is a shit, bro. Y'all ain't nothing with all the artists there. Cause what music you playing? Cause if nobody yeah. don't tune into the radio, right. y'all ain't got no jobs. You understand me? If y'all don't start supporting the local talent them, and even whether they local or they international, yeah. start supporting your own. You said man, they you always want to compare this person to the person whether um it be Jamaican to Guyanese. Oh, Jamaica is different. Jamaica is different. My point exactly. exactly. It, makes, it makes no sense. You feel me? They don't support. They don't do nothing. When it comes to media in Guyana, they don't support, period. Yeah. And it's 2018 we in. I remember coming up with Jory from since 2007, 2008 time. And them niggas used to tell me, say, yo. I used, I, no, first I used to tell them, I say, yo, yeah. Give me a bus, give me a bus, give me a bus. Because I always had a vision and I know what I wanted to do inside yeah. me. Yo, get me in this, yo, get me in the. And them niggas tell me, say, yo, you're too young, now. Like, you know the business, whatever, whatever. Which was true, I was pretty young then. But shit, I still knew what I wanted to do because look how far Prada came, look how far, look how far I come. You understand me? And I was pushing Prada back then, inside me. Mm -hmm. Look how far I come. Let's talk about the truth, it was good. Yeah. None of y'all DJs and promoters don't make it. And now, the I hear platform, think I'm afraid to call y'all out? Hell no. Y'all trip it. Speak now. Let's talk about the truth. Make a chop now. Let's speak about the truth. I'm gonna step high. I'm bad here. Everyone know why nobody don't respect the Guyanese. Everyone know why not your black no song Guyanese. Everyone know why the world don't even know a Guyanese. Guyanese fight against Guyanese. Jeez, the selectors and the DJs, them I say them I put on for the country. Them no one play the artists, cause them say we are sing fuckery. Brother, who know I share and I support fuckery? T-Drop, Wi-Fi, one bag of shed grip. Listen to the talent. I ain't gonna lie. Guyana got a lot of talent. He got mad talent, man. There's a lot of artists period with a bunch of talent, but they don't push them because I remember when fucking um with with the nigga name but T drop nigga yeah he come out on Facebook start doing dumb shit T drop end up on stage doing shows doing this interviews and all that yeah. then Wi Fi come out and with them there no way hmm. but at the end of the day all the original talent still doing music yeah. them still pushing. I'm still trying to get boss, and none of y'all still in one give them it. But at the end of the day, none of y'all can do it either. We gotta be better than Jamaica, by far. It's, it's not, even, not even about the Jamaican spirit. It's, it's, it's strictly when it comes to Guyana and the, and the music scene. Like, nobody that got a platform don't want to do nothing for them artists, honestly. Mm -hmm. uh, from the time that I started doing music in the whole in 2007, I probably be into honestly like three interviews. Okay. You think I you know? You understand me? And I'm always calling and them thing. But once once they see the the shine on you and them side the thing, once they once they see the shine on you, the light, then them is one. Oh, boom boom boom! Come do this! Come do that! Come do that! Nah, everything now costs money, dog. You understand me? I ain't gonna do an event in Guyana until I could sell out the stadium. You understand me? And I gonna prove it to y'all. Watch it. That's why nobody don't respect me. That's why nobody don't respect me in the street. No, no, no. I know I see that terrible tell. Yo, look up, yo, Marcus. Let's talk about the truth. Let's speak about the truth. Let's talk about the truth. Top, crown, king, done. Hey. Let's talk about the truth. Let's speak about the truth. Let's talk about the truth. That's why I'm more so we know clear mono. You see? As far as Uno know, we're from Jamaica. 
Keep it like that. Cause I name show more is support, you see? Canada, England. Huh? Think shot at London. Think shot at Dominican Republic. Shout out. <laughs> Let's talk about the truth. Part one. I bet ya. Next time I hear you say when I have talent up. Yeah. I'm gonna see. Time. You don't have part two today? Huh? No, there's no part two. Yes, yeah, straight G. Hmm. Part two needed to come out, you understand? Which I, I, I now run into part one, you said, but yeah, yo, we need a part two already, said. Um, what's your what's your opinion on on the whole concept and everything? Man, I like I, I like the beat, mm. and he he on fire, man. He just he just he said he doesn't call the promoters, and so he's on fire. Yo, you already know what it is, man. I honestly feel like he's on point yeah. because a lot of stuff that I grew up with. Mm-hmm. Within the trying to get into the industry and everything, mm-hmm. he actually mentioned the whole strip. Yeah, you understand. I mean, he mentioned the whole the whole case and everything. Yeah, so because the promoters don't support the the promoters don't even want to book you that. Yeah, so and when they book you, they want to pay you nothing or nothing. You understand me? Which yeah. in like 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 the US. You think a promoter could come in, tell me, yo, come to I roll this and host an event or whatever? Nah, first thing I need, bottles. I don't even drink, but I need bottles. I need private. I need VIP section. I need bottles. I need money. The most important thing. So I need upfront. I need back end. I come in like an artist. Because when yeah. I come in through, I come in through the whole squad. I roll this down. You feel me? So when I'm coming through, I need ballers for my people. I need my upfront money from way before. So when I step in the building, I need my rest of money. And I need the VIP section. Of course. You feel me? Guyana, yeah, I need to do better. Guyana, period. Yeah. Everybody needs to do better. The people need to support them on. Yeah. Whether it's fuckery music, you understand me? Or regardless, because even when artists drop garbage music, you got to critique it. Say, yo, this is trash. Not just boom and skip over. You got to let them know. Say, yo, you're putting out garbage. Yeah. Your quality sucks. Yeah. This bad. The bad. Everything. You understand me? You got to yeah. drop it from A to Z on them. That's the only way they could walk and get better. Because if you're telling them, say, yo, quality sucks. You think anybody can go fix them quality? No. Exactly. If you tell them, say, yo, lyrics garbage. You think anybody can go walk on them lyrics? Exactly, you understand me. So, Guyanese people need to tell each other say when you're messing up, when you're doing right, and when you're doing wrong, when when you're good, when you're bad, whatever. You say, man, Guyanese the people in the whole need to do that. Now the promoters them, y'all ain't gonna make it that. Unless, y'all really come together and bring the artists them up. I ain't gonna lie to you, man. There's so much artists and how much of them. Pr- Performing every weekend in Ghana. Right. Ghana have so many artists, but the problem is they're not getting the support from the people. Shit, exactly. Yeah. And even when they get the support from the people, most of them out in the US. Yeah. That's that's the only set of people that support the people inside of Ghana don't support the people inside yeah. of Ghana, bro. It's just like me. When I was in there, and that that's how I learned this part, you understand me? When I was in there, nobody wasn't showing me love. Soon as I step up, everybody, yo, how you do this? Yo, how you do that? Yo, nah, don't even call my phone now. That's why I'm only rocking with artists. Any artist could hit me up any day, yo. Only if your music good. Mm-hmm. You understand, man? I can critique li- lyrics later on, but once your, once your quality is of standard, hit me up. I throw your music up. I support. You understand, man? Because I wish I had them side of support back in the days when I started doing what I was doing. Yeah. You understand, man? But, man, they just need to do better, period, man. You feel me? Promoters, them, the DJs, them, the media yeah. personnel. Y'all just need to do better. Because, honestly, right now, y'all ain't serving no purpose, man. Yeah. 
and especially the internet. Soon as Guyan, soon as Guyanese artists learn how to lock up on the internet, y'all is not needed. The radio is not needed. Mm -hmm. The promoters is not needed okay. because artists can't afford to get to anywhere in Guyana and put on a show. A DJ is easy for come back. Half of the guy and I pretty sure got iPhones and if everybody ain't got iPhone yet. All you got is plug up your phone, Bluetooth, throw it on a speaker, and you got a party. You could charge the people yourself for coming to dance. You understand me? All you need is a venue. You don't need no promoter. Yeah. You could push it yourself. You see? You need half of them stuff that you're supposedly telling them they need. See, man? But soon they lock up on the internet, man. The music scene over for Guyana, the media scene period over yo. You understand me? But we ain't gonna carry it too long. Y'all just need to do better, man. Y'all just need to do better. The media, y'all need to do better. If y'all wanna stay relevant, y'all need to do better, honestly. But you already know. Let me know y'all opinion on the song. You feel me? The song is titled The Truth by Bad Yeah. Let me know y'all opinion. Let me know which other artists I should do a review of, you feel me? I've been getting good feedback from the last two videos I've dropped. Appreciate all the love from everybody. You already know Team of Hero is life of a high roller, man. Oh, yeah. That's it. I'm the reason why my city hot. I'm the reason why they spinning blocks. Niggas hating and they turn cops. Get the word and I get the drop. Word of me and I hit the spot.